Welcome to part three of this eDesign Suite video series. In this episode, you will learn how to use the interactive dashboard to visualize, understand, and refine your design's operating conditions and performance. In the previous video, we've selected and started an ACDC isolated flyback converter design project and loaded the project's dashboard. At a glance, you can now see and alter all default values and monitor key metrics. These include current and voltage waveform analysis, system efficiency, Bodhi diagrams, power losses distribution, an overview of your project specifications where you can modify desired operating conditions. The dashboard is updated in real time as you make changes. This section lets you review actual operating conditions. At any time, you can change any of your project specifications. You can do this in three different ways. All methods give you access to the design wizard. First method, directly from the interactive bill of material. For instance, let's change the C-out capacitor value on the output stage. Choose another capacitor from a list of available devices. The outcome of your modification is immediately reflected by the different graphs and charts. Next, you can also change your project specifications from the circuit schematic. For instance, let's modify the input stage rectifier. Likewise, we can also change our transformer type. Let's choose a custom type. Then go to the Transformer Details section and click on the Transformer's description. The Transformer Design sub-window lets you customize various aspects, including primary, secondary, and auxiliary windings and wire type. You can also change the core type by clicking here. Select the shape that best fits your application's requirements. Let's keep the default, so click Cancel and return to the dashboard. Finally, you can directly open the Change Specifications panel using the button located here. At any time, click Auto Complete to let the tool automatically choose the best parameters for your needs. The Design Wizard gives you control on all aspects of your project specifications, including input-output specifications, general constraints, input stage, device settings, transformer type, and details. You can verify all clamper net parameters, output stage parameters, and all compensation net specifications. We'll see you in the next episode with more tips to master the eDesign suite. Keep watching and learn your way around the tool in no time.